Watford three, Wolverhampton Wanderers two. Aiden, pinch me, mate. I don't know what I've just witnessed there. I'm still struggling. It's been a good hour or so since the bloody final whistle went, and I'm still. I don't know what to say, I've lost words. Someone need, needs to give me a reality check because I generally cannot believe that's happened. When we were 2-0 down, we looked like we were done. We looked like we were killed. But then Delafeu, so cheeky with that goal. You can't give him that time in the box. Otherwise, he'll go, see you later. That's that's a goal. We're back in the game. Then penalty, going, going to v VAR penalty all, no, all day long. And there was just so much power on that penalty, the keeper had no chance whatsoever. And then when when we were 2-2, two, 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 we knew we could do it. We knew we could go on, win the game, no matter whether it's getting another goal in extra time, we're going to penalties. One way or the other, we were gonna win win this game. They were coming back against Manchester City. It's been done before, they can be beat here, and we're gonna do it. <laughs> Brilliant way to sum it up. Did you really think, I've said it to everyone, when we were 2-0 down, 15 minutes to go, did you really think we were going to get back into it? I generally thought we were done. Because yeah. Wolves, one way or the other, are a very, very tough team to break break down. Especially on the counter-attack as well. Yeah, and when De Delefeu ca came on, they didn't know how to handle him. And it was my ma man of the match, yeah. one way or the other. No matter whether he was on for five minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, no matter what, he was our man, man of the match and we needed, we needed him starting against City. MKM starting against City and going into that game, Nick, um, Aiden. Do you reckon we could win it? Of course we can win it. We're a Super One fan! 2-0, yeah! 15 minutes to go and you're thinking, oh, it's listen, gone, we're out. We've been, here, we've been here many times. We've seen, we've seen it go the same way every time. But my, my missus told me, believe, and I did, and it's happened. Listen, we're going, we're going to Wembley again in bloody May. We're in the FA Cup final, I can't believe it. Is this real? Because I can't actually believe it, mate. Watford, I love you. What a club. What a bloody club. Right, I know you're over from Spain. Over from and Spain. that man, Fayou again, off the bench. Bloody I was worried. hell, mate. When I saw him on the bench, I was worried. But he's come off the bench and he scored two goals. Absolute worldies as well. The way he took oh, the second one. The first one. Oh, oh, stop oh, it. What a player. Listen, Watford FC, we can win it. We're going to win it. Actually, this is our year. Oh, we're going to fucking... We're going to win it. We're going to win it. Why not? We've come this far. You know what I mean? Give me a hug, man. Javi Garcia, I'd like to call you dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, just everything about that, this club now. If we, that was under Marco Silva or Kike, we'd have gone on to lose that 5-0. Just the belief in the team, everyone's belief in each other, the, the belief in the fans, it's just, it was amazing. The atmosphere was amazing, just a perfect day. No, I think you're spot on with that, the belief. It's something, since Garcia's coming, the character, the spirit, and when you're 2-0 down with 12 minutes, I think Robin said, to go, to pull it back to 2-2 and then to go on and win it, see you later, to go on and win it. You couldn't write that script, you really couldn't. Yeah, the subs were amazing. I thought he was right to take off Will Hughes, he had a poor game. Massive shout out, Roberto Pereira. Best game in the Watfordshire. Fantastic. Have amazing shift, moving his body about. It's quite surprising considering the sun wasn't out. <laughs> <laughs> um, Messina was excellent, Ken Semmel was excellent when he came on. And obviously, He's magic. Fucking yes. <laughs> Nick Hill, talk oh. to me about that one, mate. Unbelievable scenes. Oh, mate, what a game. You know, so, it's, if this isn't a nerve-wracking game, I don't know what is. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, what a win. Oh, I can't believe it. You know what? The overall game, it wasn't great. It wasn't great at all. I thought we were shocking. But when it mattered, we scored two goals. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. It's hard to sum up, Nick. We're two 0 down. Mm. Fifteen minutes to go. Yeah, but we showed fight and desire. Like we know we can, and that's the thing, you know. And that's what matters at the end of the day. Sometimes you win ugly. You really do win ugly, but it doesn't matter. As long as we we in to the final now, that's all that matters. And I thought. We attack them, attack them, because I wasn't scared going into this game. I thought we better than Wolves, really. But you know what? We did it, and that's all. We did it the hard way, Nickel, though. Yeah. No, of course, we did it the hard way, but then you can't... This is the FA Cup semi-final, and in this game, sort of 50-50 as well, so... That's it. That's I mean, we've got that belief now going to the final, Nickel. It's that's going to be it. tough against Manchester City, but we've seen it before. Big teams get knocked out, and we've got a real chance now, Nickel, to, to win a bit of silverware. And who would have thought that, really? No one, but the thing is, I'm not fearing Man City. We're Watford, and I've always said this. I said this, we need to aim high and aim really high. And we get a trophy under the belts, and Javi 
I believe in him so much and the players now that every time, because he's played um, Man City twi two, three times now, and now he's learnt, he's probably learnt how to deal with them and he probably would have watched last night and going in, depends how the season goes up till then, obviously, because the final's on the 18th of May and stuff, but you know what, we shouldn't fear Man City, we got this far and we beat, and these teams, people think beating Woking and that is easy, but it's not because they gave it a good game and Newcastle, every game is tough and we shouldn't fear Man City, we should go into it with positive head and we can do it and we are the Orns, we know mugs, you know. Love that. Nick Hill, safe journey home, we'll see you in May. Come here, mate, top bloke. Two words, fucking hell. Fucking hell, we got away with that one. Look, first half was poor, obviously, both teams were poor, weren't they? But they got the first goal, which could have been defended better, but come out. You think that 2-0 was game over. I mean, because we just didn't defend, but like we've got to go out of nothing. It just looked like it was over at 2-0, Tom, and then I it don't just, know what what happened. I think it was obviously a Delafay. Delafay. I think the fans were deflated when that second goal went in. I was deflated. I just... But then Delafay came on, he got to go out of nowhere. He thought, fuck, it's John Ruddy. Over you go. Yeah, yeah. And then you, you started to believe then, and then the, the, the balls from Troy to step up and put that in, mate. How many times he delivered for Watford Football Club? He's a legend. Simple as that. Um, no, we, I think Wolves didn't deserve the way it happened. So f fair credit to them, they play well, but I don't give a fuck. We're through to the final. And and telephone at the end, I mean, counter it, just me it was just meant to be after that. I've always felt when that, when, that yeah. That was it. That was it, really, weren't it? But it was a typical Watford counter-attack from us, out of nowhere, but I'm nearly, I'm nearly, yeah, to keep the emotions in. Yeah, yeah. Just Tom, Tom, I'll let you go, mate, but thanks for copping along. Fuck it, I'll see you back here next we'll week. See you in a bit, man. Sum that up, mate. I can't. This club is taking about 20 years off our lives already, <laughs> and we're, what, 17, 18? Um, two nil down, 78th minute, Delafay. We brought him on, him and Gray are so similar. They come off the bench, they make an impact, they start and they're a bit iffy. But Delafay, fair fucks to him for thinking, it's John Ruddy, I'll try and chip him. <laughs> and then the momentum just shifted so much. Like, where was that team for the first 75 minutes? Um, Dini, that penalty, so much power on it. John Ruddy didn't stand a chance, no wonder. Big goal for no, a big game player. He, well, he dived the right way as well. So it's, it's, so, it's Dini, isn't it? Mr Watford taking us to Europe, either in the league or by winning the FA Cup. So we've got viable routes now. Um, big shout out to all the subs that came on, Ken Semmer, and Messina. Jorelio Gomez in goal. Massive catches, massive, just commanding that back four at the end. But I think for an extra time defensively, we were absolute quality. And that's how we need to play against Man City because they will not let up. We've already played them twice this season. Unlucky decision at theirs in terms of VAR, we have it this time. Um, at the Vic, we were 2 0 down, brought it back to 2 1, could have drawn. So anything can happen in the FA Cup. Come on, what the? Do you know what? I put it on Facebook after their second goal. Uh, no, I didn't want to win the FA Cup anyway. And to actually, to standing here now in the final, I just can't believe it. What a game! What a game! You know, we, you know, first I played really, really well. They scored. You know, the momentum went down for us, and then they scored again. But we, all, we, we turned it round. I just can't believe we that that goal from Delafeu. Seriously, what the hell? <laughs> he just, he just like, he just just went. I'm just gonna try it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. It went in, and then having a penalty as well. Go for us in the yeah, last yeah, minute. Yeah. Usually, it's against us. It's just no words, really. I'm just gonna go out there and get pissed <laughs> because you know we're in the final of the FA Cup. Sorry, boss. I'm not gonna be in tomorrow. Can we see Troy Deeney lifting that FA Cup? Of course we can. Of course we can. There's a sign there that says "Magic of the FA Cup." and we can do it. We can win the FA Cup. I personally do believe it. Now we're in the final, I'm going to have pink hair. Yeah, thank you, Pidge, for that. But it's just no words. How do you describe this feeling, you know? I'm sure it'll be a lot better when you have a few drinks tonight, mate. Oh, I'm going to be pissed. Don't worry about that. <laughs>